Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to day four, I think, of Vlogmas. Today, as you can tell from the title, I am bringing you a gift guide for her, which I kind of thought would be useful if you've got to buy for your mum, your aunties, your sisters, your friends, whoever you have in your life that you might be stuck on gift ideas for. I've tried to kind of go a little bit out there with also the classics of just the perfect presents that literally anyone would be happy to receive. So I'm gonna run over them with you guys today. I'm gonna try and keep it quite short and sweet because I've got quite a lot to show you guys but yeah, that being said, make sure you hit subscribe if you wanna stick around for more videos in the future. I am currently doing Vlogmas. I am posting a video every other day on my YouTube channel. So if you wanna stick around for that, then definitely hit subscribe. But also make sure you follow me on Instagram. Give this video a thumbs up if you do enjoy it. And yeah, let's get straight into it. I'm gonna start off with a little bit of a classic and that is makeup. I know it's not everybody's cup of tea, but I feel like makeup is a gift if you do know someone that is obsessed with it. It's such a good opportunity to buy someone something that they kind of wanna invest in, but they don't really wanna spend their own money on. So I've got some Charlotte Tilbury products here because we all know Charlotte Tilbury isn't the cheapest, but their makeup is unreal. Like I absolutely love it. If you love like a glowy, dewy base, if you love really quite minimal makeup, then I couldn't recommend this stuff more. And I know there's a lot of people out there that would absolutely love it. So I'm sure you guys probably know someone that would love this as a gift. Things I would personally recommend are the Hollywood Flawless Filter. I love this so, so much. Mine is completely worn out, as you can probably see. And then also this is a new product that I've been loving recently. This is the Airbrush Flawless Finish. This is just a finishing powder, as the name suggests. And I've just been loving it. Like I say, it's really minimal. Um, easy to pop in your handbag as well, it's super slim. And then also this is one of my new absolute staples. This is the Magic Serum Crystal Elixir. This honestly feels so nice on your skin before makeup. This is quite pricey. I would say it's about, I wanna say it's 50 pounds or something like that. I know not everyone wants to indulge that much on their self, but it's such a treat if you do want to purchase it for someone. Forgot to mention, but all of these items that I'm showing you guys will be linked down below in the description. So if you do see anything that you kind of wanna pick up or take a further look at, then definitely head down there and the links will be there. Something that I feel is kind of underestimated when it comes to Christmas is pajamas. I personally have a really poor excuse for a pajama drawer. Like I barely have any sets. I have been purchasing some recently for that exact reason. So I've got a couple of sets to show you here, but again, I think they make such a nice gift. Like no one's gonna say no to a pair of cute, cozy pajamas. Obviously it's completely up to you guys like how much you wanna indulge, how much money you wanna spend. There's obviously higher ends, there's lower ends, there's more high street brands. I have just picked out a couple of my favorite brands, especially with pajamas. So this is a little, Angel Collection set. This is actually one of their short sleeve sets, which I feel like is perfect kind of all year round. Cause I love to snuggle up in these in the winter with a dressing gown over the top as well. But obviously in the summer, these are so good. It's just in this gorgeous oatmeal color. And I mean, the quality of this stuff is beautiful. Again, makes the perfect gift. So these are really, really sweet. That is the top half. And then the bottoms are just these little shorts. They're super high waisted as well. So they're really comfortable and they obviously have the drawstring waist. I just think they're really sweet. Like all of the little details really nicely made and everything so yeah such a nice little treat for someone and then this set here is something i picked up recently this is actually from sisters and seekers i absolutely love this brand you guys probably know that if you've been here for a while and saying that if you know someone that's like really into their fashion and loves like a graphic kind of sweater like this this is from sisters and seekers as well so that would probably make a great place to buy gifts from especially if you have like a sister or something and you know her style pretty well then i couldn't recommend this brand more as well but these are the pajamas that i picked up so they're just like a really cute little checkered shirt set and then they come with matching shorts as well. I actually think these are gonna be my Christmas morning pajamas and I'm kind of excited about that. Like to spend my whole day in these is gonna be a dream. So next, something that you can probably spend a little bit more money on, I would say this is gonna be like the perfect gift for your mum or someone you just wanna absolutely spoil this year. I always think a pair of staple earrings is such a nice gift because it's something that someone's gonna have forever, providing they don't lose them. But yeah, I just think it's so nice to invest in a piece of jewellery for someone. To be fair, it could be a necklace, a bracelet, it could be anything. But I personally love a pair of staple earrings that I just get so much wear out of. So you guys have probably seen me wear these before. These are my Balenciaga hoops. I know they're designer. I know they are, I want to say like £350. So like I say, this is a very, very indulgent gift. Or for example, if you're one of the lads out there watching this and you want to really treat your girlfriend this year, then I would highly recommend these. I feel like they're just going to be around forever. 
and they are such a gorgeous style. They go with everything. I wear them all the time. Like I could not recommend these more. But obviously there are so many jewelry brands like Astrid and Miu, there's Majuri, there's so many other brands that obviously have a bit of a lower price point, but you just wanna go for something that isn't gonna tarnish and is like real gold or gold plated at least. Um, so that person can obviously keep the gift forever and it's not gonna tarnish or anything like that. Hair tools, something that again, I feel like not all of us think to pick up for ourselves, but we really appreciate when we have them. So I've got this new one here from Beauty Works and I literally just use this. You might've seen me use it in, or you will see me use it in the next Vlogmas video, literally to style my hair like I have here. So I really recommend this. I wasn't sure at first, I wasn't sure how well it was gonna work, but it works really, really nicely. So it's basically just like a hot tools brush, which obviously straightens your hair as you brush it through. So I let my hair dry naturally and then I literally just comb it through with this and it makes it dead straight. So I've been really loving this and I just thought it would actually be such a good gift because I know not everybody would have these. I feel like we all kind of have straighteners and we take our brush and straighten our hair with that. But this honestly gets your hair done in like two minutes. So if you know someone with a busy lifestyle, then I honestly think this would be perfect for them. You also get this really nice leather the travel case in the little package as well so it's like two gifts in one um i just wanted to recommend this because i've been really enjoying it personally another product that i feel is a pretty underrated gift only because i don't know i don't think many people think of this because again we've all got a makeup bag in our lives but i am the worst at renewing my makeup bags mine all get so dirty like beyond repair and i always forget to buy myself a new one so i thought as a christmas gift it would actually be quite good just because like i said i don't think many people go out of their way to renew their makeup bags so i picked up this one from sisters and seekers as well it was just in a sale but obviously you can get makeup bags pretty much anywhere i know boots has the ted baker ones um there's so many different brands it's just really up to you guys again how much you want to spend and things like that but yeah i've just switched all my makeup over to this one it's a little bit more travel size friendly as well so a makeup bag is a good staple for a makeup lover. Sticking on that same kind of realm, I guess, I wanted to show you guys some of my favorite Kiehl's products. So I know skincare can be a little bit of a tricky one when it comes to buying gifts, just because you're never too sure on what people's skin types could be. You don't know if they could react to something, everything like that. I think skincare is just super personal to each person. So I wanted to go with Kills because they are really natural products. They don't have any like harsh fragrances in them. They're not overly perfumed or anything like that. So I think Kills is just going to be a good all rounder. So I've got here one of their hand creams. This is the ultimate strength hand sleeve. This is actually in their limited edition um, Christmas packaging as well, which is super cute and also recyclable. And then this is my all time favorite moisturizer. I showed this in my favorites video. Um, this is the creme de crops body lotion and it's just a dream like you won't know until you've tried it but it's just the best thing ever and then finally i've got one of their face masks this is my favorite face mask that they do they do so many different face masks that are all again like super natural ingredients i love having these in the cupboard i think this one was actually a gift from last year so yeah a face mask i personally would be very happy to receive but i just love the kills ones okay something maybe a little bit random but something again i personally love having around the house and i feel like would make a sweet gift even for like birthdays or anything like that just as a general general present i absolutely love a little candle moment obviously they are super novelty and i know some of them can be a little bit more pricey so again i just think it's something that you wouldn't necessarily want to spend like loads of money on but as a gift it would be really appreciated so i've got these two which are from i believe it's canola candles i might be pronouncing that completely wrong but i will tag their instagram down below but i am just obsessed with these i love the body shapes of them i love that they are just a little bit different from the average ones that you see out there at the moment really really sweet so yeah they are the first ones that i have to show you guys and then also i have these these are from fluff wax and how cute they're little cloud candles and they're basically like a little family you can buy the big one and the little one and then i think there's an even tinier one than this i know these have been like such a hype over instagram for the longest time now so if someone is obsessed with candles but like i say doesn't want to indulge themselves then buy them as a gift let's stick with the kind of home section for now because again an underrated gift I received one of these coffee table books last year from George and I was so appreciative. I have so many around my house and I just think they are so gorgeous. So I've got a couple here to show you. I have the Soho House one, the Eat, Drink, Nap book over there, which I did just buy last year. And then I've also got the Dior one. I've got the Prada one. I've got the Tom Ford one downstairs. Like I have so many of these, but these are just some really neutral black and white ones, which I thought would kind of suit anyone's style. So this is the Chanel book. I actually got this on 
the H&M website, but I know you can get literally so many of these on Amazon. I think you can get some of them in Costco if you've got a Costco card. Um, there's so many places you can buy them. So I'll find hopefully the best price ones and link them down below. I feel like Amazon constantly has deals on things like this. But yeah, I love this Chanel book. I think it's such a classic. It looks really sweet from the side as well. And then also we have the White Company book, which again, so classic, really sleek. Like I said, I think it's just gonna suit anyone's style. But obviously in my house, these are mainly for decoration. I just think they look really nice on the side. But inside they do have all of the gorgeous like illustrations, the images. They have so many different things that anyone can sit and look at. So they're also functional. You can really dress up a home with these like bookcases or little shelving units. I think they're really sweet. Something that I obviously don't have to show you guys, but I just don't think anybody is going to be disappointed to receive is something like a spa day, any kind of experience. Yeah, I think it's Virgin that are doing a load of these like day experiences at the moment. I know you can take someone like afternoon tea at Fortnum and Mason. Um, there's loads of different things that you can purchase for someone if you want to spend money on a bit more of an experience rather than just like an actual gift, um, like a physical gift i know a lot of people like to share experiences with people especially at the moment like coming out of lockdown and things like that so yeah i think a spa day definitely i'd be very happy to receive that and i know you can get some for like 80 90 pounds and then they could maybe add on a treatment or something it kind of gives them the choice um with what they want to do with that i've actually received a spa day before and then turned it into like an overnight stay and i just paid the rest especially if you know someone that like needs to take a bit of time out they need to spoil themselves send them away on a spa day and i'm sure they'll be very grateful my one of these is downstairs and plugged in so i didn't want to carry the whole thing up here just to show you guys so i will pop a picture on screen but another gift that i bought myself but i think other people would love is a hotel chocolat velvetizer so indulgent so good but again not something that you would necessarily buy yourself if you know someone that loves hot chocolates loves any hot drink like that i know they do little coffee pods as well now which are really good by the way brad has tried one and he said it was great a little bit of a random one but i thought if you have anyone that you know loves kind of working out or especially loves like a home workout or something like that i thought the gym gear would be a really good option to go for as a gift for those people and also i thought gym accessories so i went on gymshark the other day because they have or had their massive black friday sale running and i actually picked up these resistant bands they just come in a little pack of three i think in the sale these were like 15 pounds i want to say but i don't think they were much more than that full price like i say if you know someone that's maybe just getting into working out or like absolutely loves it then i would recommend something like this so you get the heavy weight the medium weight and the lightweight and then i also saw this on the website so i thought i'd pick it up i did again get these for myself but i just thought if there are people that you know that love this kind of stuff then it's such a great time to buy them these little gifts but this is one of those like resistance again like a resistance band but it has the little hand pulls on it so you can kind of pop it under your foot do some bicep curls whatever you want to do um just another really good accessory i just thought a little bit rogue but i'm sure there's people out there that you guys know that would appreciate something like this okay a classic some slippers again you can invest in these you could get some ugg slippers whatever brand you want to get i feel like ugg is the queen of slippers so i always go for them but these are actually from h&m i have worn these to death they are looking a little bit raggedy so i'm not going to bring them too close but these are just some really gorgeous fluffy slippers again no one is going to say no to these and i do feel like you could never have enough slippers even though i have about 10 pairs but you can never have enough so even if they've got some that are looking a bit old a little bit ratty get them a new pair and i'm sure they will appreciate it so like i say these are from h&m i will try and link these ones down below but i know the white company have some very similar i'm sure primark do a load that look exactly like this so you can kind of just shop around and see what you prefer something that i don't actually have to show you guys but i did buy someone as a gift last year is a polaroid printer so obviously the brand polaroid sell the really gorgeous like classic old school polaroid cameras and i know they can be kind of expensive i know the film can be kind of expensive i feel like we all always have our phones on us we're always constantly taking pictures so it basically means that you can take all your pictures on your phone and then you scan your phone on top of this printer and it prints your pictures out as a little polaroid so if you don't want to invest in the camera or 
someone's been looking at one but they're not really sure about like getting that perfect shot for the first time then I would highly recommend this because you don't even need the camera you just need your phone um I think it's on sale at the moment for around 90 pounds so again it's a little bit more of an expensive gift but so worth it in my opinion like to be able to print off all those memories you can go back in your camera roll and print off loads of like past memories that you have and then I guess a gift that could go alongside that is maybe like a scrapbook or something especially if you know someone might be traveling or something very soon um then yeah a whole little gift set like that would be so so good <laughs> i feel so bad i have my dressing gown down here because again dressing gown great gift idea um but bonnie is currently curled up like fast asleep on it so i was planning on showing you guys but i really don't want to disturb her i have this bit to show you <laughs> this is the belt it's literally just like the fluffiest coziest dressing gown ever from m s actually i find that they do the best ones so i'll link some options but I just don't want to disturb the pup. She looks so peaceful. <laughs> Another little indulgement item for me would be a reed diffuser. Not a reed diffuser, a room diffuser. But these are the electric ones. This is the one that I have from Neom. I love this so much. It puts the most gorgeous scent into the air. I use essential oils in it and like lavender oils, spa like oils. I just love it. I believe I actually bought one of these as a gift last year and i know the person was really happy about it so i wanted to recommend this one especially because it does have like the timers to it neom have some really gorgeous scents of their essential oils as well so you can kind of get it all in one place okay final kind of brand that i'm going to recommend because i don't have all of my products here to show you guys but sol de janeiro products they are a dream they are a little bit more expensive again, but I know that so many people love this stuff. It just smells like holiday in a bottle. Like I can't even describe this. You just need it in your life um, or the person you're buying for it needs it in their life. But yeah, they have so many different body sprays. They have gorgeous hair products. They have shampoos, conditioners. I have a really nice hair mask from them that I use all the time. They have so much stuff. So I'm gonna link their website down below and I'll link a couple of my favorite products. Um, just because I know, I just know so many people love that stuff. And I think I watched George's gift guide and I think Liv actually showed a like gift set from Sol de Janeiro and it wasn't, I think it wasn't crazy expensive, but like the packaging and everything was gorgeous. So I'll try and find that and link it as well because I thought that would be a really good idea to kind of have everything as one. But yeah, I think that is kind of it for my gift guide. I hope this helped in some way. It's obviously quite hard to think of like brand new things that maybe somebody else hasn't shown or something like that but I wanted to just recommend a couple of brands and um, maybe jog your memory on a few little gift ideas if you are a bit stuck like I say these would just be perfect for any woman in your life um, I'm sure they would be very appreciative of everything that I have showed you guys today let's have a little chat in the comments let me know what you would personally ask for for Christmas out of these items that I've just showed you guys so what was your favorite product that I showed what would you want to get your hands on let me know in the comments and I will be down there as soon as this video goes live replying to you all but yeah thank you so much for watching as always like I said at the start if you want to stick around for more vlogmas videos please feel free to hit subscribe I have a playlist on my channel if you want to go back and watch the other few days that you might have missed then please feel free to do so but I'm going to wrap this video up here and hopefully I'll speak to you guys very soon in my next one bye guys <laughs>